What is up guys? So today I have here the Samsung Galaxy S24 Plus and today I'm going to be comparing it to the upcoming Galaxy Z Flip 6 to see which one you should get if you should get the Galaxy S24 Plus now or wait for the Galaxy Z Flip 6 in literally four days. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to compare between these two devices is the cameras. So obviously, if you know me, the cameras are the most important aspect of any phone that I review. And the S24 Plus has a main 50 megapixel sensor for the um, just, you know, regular camera. And the same with the Galaxy Z Flip, uh, yeah, Z Flip 6. It's going to have um, practically the same sensor and 50 megapixel resolution. So, I mean, that's, I'm super excited for that. So for the main camera, same resolution. Um, same for the ultra wide, we're going to have a 12 megapixel ultra wide on both of the phones. But what the Z Flip 6 doesn't have that the Galaxy S24 Plus does have is a telephoto lens. So obviously the Z Flip 6 only has three cameras on the entire phone, while the S24 Plus has four. And we have a 12 megapixel ultra wide on the S24 Plus. Um, so I'm pretty excited to see what um, Samsung's going to do to add some AI enhancements with the Z Flip 6 battery, or battery, with the camera capability and just overall performance. So for cameras, I think they're going to be pretty much the same, but um, if you want to see for sure, I'm going to have a camera test as soon as the device comes out. Um, so definitely subscribe and stick around for that video. And also for the selfie camera, the Galaxy S24 Plus has a 12 megapixel selfie camera, while the Z Flip 6 is going to have a 10 megapixel selfie camera. So, um, higher resolution on the plus which is i guess more expected because it's uh, like the super high-end phone even though they're, they're both of these phones are the exact same price so i would definitely like to see a better megapixel count for the selfie camera but as long as samsung makes it so it can take great photos i think that's all that matters okay and now for the screen so the galaxy s24 plus has a udc Sorry, a quad HD plus resolution, and it's honestly really nice and crisp. You can see like the different comparisons, and the Z Flip 6 will have a FHD plus resolution. So as you can see the comparison, so it's not going to be as crispy, um, but it's definitely going to be super nice, and uh, you're not going to have any issues with the like um, resolution. It's just not going to be as crisp as the S24 plus. And as for brightness, the Galaxy Z Flip, um, no, the Galaxy S24 plus comes in um, 2,600 nits of peak brightness, and we're expecting the flip to either get the same or 2000 nits of peak brightness we're thinking probably 2000 nits um because the z fold 6 is confirmed to have 2600 so we think it might be 2000 for the flip not quite sure um hopefully obviously samson will or ho obviously hopefully samson goes for the higher nits but we're gonna just gonna have to just you know wait and see um but yeah so for the display it's gonna be pretty similar um 200 in her or 120 hertz refresh rate pretty standard um, for, you know, both phones. So yeah, both phones are gonna have great screens. Brightness might vary though. Okay, and now for durability, which is something that's obviously super important. So on the Galaxy S24 Plus and the Z Flip 6, they'll be both utilizing the Gorilla Glass Victus 2 for the glass on the back of, well, the S24 Plus uses it on the back of the screen, but the Z Flip 5 6 will just be using it on the back glass and the cover display. And then they will both utilize Armor Aluminum. It'll be a brushed alloy kind of feel. So it's going to be super nice. Similar speaker to grow, design, everything. Um, but then on the in like on the display, the inner display on the Galaxy Z Flip 6, obviously the um, you know, S24 Plus doesn't have a foldable screen. Um, we're going to get the Iron Flex technology on the screen on the Galaxy Z Flip 6. So I'm super excited to see how durable that is. It will have a less prominent crease. So obviously the crease will be less noticeable. That's what that means. Um, and it's going to be super nice. I'm super excited to see what it looks like and the improvements in durability. Um, so for screens, obviously the Z Flip 6 screen isn't going to be as durable as the S24 Plus is. But considering you're not going to just be having your um, Z Flip 6 open and on the table moving around all the time it's not going to be a big issue but for durability both are pretty much the same okay and now for just overall which one i think is better since they are both the same price they're both roughly around one thousand dollars um honestly i would say the s24 plus and the z flip 6 are pretty much equal devices um you are going to have a slightly smaller battery with the galaxy z flip 6 um, but it's going to be, you know, bigger than it was last year. So you're going to get better battery life. They're promising up to 22 hours of screen on time and playback and everything. So we're going to have to see how everything rings true when the device is released. Uh, but yeah, so honestly, I would say both are the same. It's kind of what you're like looking for. If you want the, um, a non-foldable phone, 
um, that's I guess a little bit more reliable. Definitely go with the Z or the, with the S twenty four plus, obviously. And then if you want to try a folding phone, I think this year is the best year to join the foldable market because you're going to be getting a more reliable phone with better you know durability performance new ai features better cameras better like internal screen which also goes with durability um but yeah i would personally pick up the galaxy z flip 6 just because you know i'm into foldable phones and i really like them like i'm filming on my z flip 5 right now um yeah so definitely consider subscribing for my comparison between the z flip 6 and the s24 plus once i have them in person or once i have the z flip 6 in person same with the z flip 5 versus z flip 6 and just a bunch of other videos on the Z Flip 6. So yeah, definitely consider subscribing for all of those videos. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video, and I'll see you then.